There are many reasons why people suffer from gastrointestinal disease, for instance, because of dietary issues, health issues, or circumstances out of control. Here at Memorial Long Beach Medical Center, advanced technology allows for therapeutic endoscopy procedures. We're going to talk with Medical Director of Advanced Endoscopy Services at Long Beach Medical Center, Dr. Jose Luis Arañez, and one of his patients about the process and procedure. Okay, I'm here with Dr. Jose Luis Arañez, who is the Interventional Gastroenterologist. How are you doing today? I'm doing well. Uh, thanks for taking the time to, uh, to speak to us and uh, for, you, for you guys to see what we are able to do for our community here. Well, absolutely. Thank you for actually making the time because we know you're about to take on this procedure for Ali. What is it that you're going to be doing exactly? I met our patient uh, a couple weeks ago for a pretty common uh, reason in the office. He was hospitalized and had a case of acute pancreatitis and he had an uh, imaging study that raised concern for a possible lesion in his pancreas. This procedure is pretty common, so a lot of the cases that we see uh, were tasked with the idea of making sure that this is not anything that's cancerous. And so the endoscopic ultrasound is an uh, endoscopic procedure that we're able to offer our patient that combines endoscopy and ultrasound. So we're able to look at structures behind the stomach and the duodenum. In this case, we're looking at the pancreas to further characterize what they saw on the, on the MRI. And how do you do that through that endoscopy? It, sound, it seems to sound like an advanced therapeutic technology of some sort. Uh, this kind of technology has been around for about 20 years now, and uh, it's really revolutionized what we're able to do with gastroenterology. Um, most gastroenterologists are able to diagnose uh, difficulty swallowing or dysphagia, conditions like acid reflux, uh, peptic ulcer disease, and colonoscopy with colon cancer screening. But really with the advent of endoscopic ultrasound, we've been able to diagnose uh, a lot more uh, lesions within the pancreas and also the bile duct. The first thing that we typically do is just a diagnostic upper endoscopy. Um, the upper endoscopy scope is about the size of your pinky, and we're really looking at your esophagus, stomach, and duodenum. The endoscopic ultrasound is a bigger scope, so I typically do a diagnostic upper endoscopy first just to make sure that that scope can pass through without any issues. So once the upper endoscopy is done, then we conduct our endoscopic ultrasound examination, and we'll look at the pancreas in two different stations, one within the stomach and one within the duodenum. I'm here with Ali Madhavyani at the Long Beach Medical Center. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling very well. I'm feeling very good. Uh, I'm prepared for this procedure. And uh, uh, considering uh, the personnel in the hospital, and especially Dr. Aranias, you know, I'm positive that I'm in, in, in very good hands. So uh, looking forward to get it done and go home. Well, I mean, the personnel are great. I mean, uh, it was. But inside personnel are great, you know. They, I can't ask for better people, you know. It's uh, they've been very caring, and you know, very very cordial, very respectful, and and I can't ask for anything more. Anybody would be concerned with any kind of medical procedure, you know. But concerning it does not mean that you're scared, you know. I mean. When I had to deal, uh, you know, with uh, flying the 747 for so many years, you know, 450 people on board on, on a 10-hour or 11-hour or 2-hour, 12-hour flight, I was in control. So at that time, passenger depended on me, and I think, thank God, I have to uh, really, I was blessed not uh, in 43 years, not a single incident, not a one people and not a single person dropping one drop of blood anywhere you know so uh, and i carried i think roughly over six million people here and there but uh, now it's the situation is the other way around i'm the passenger and dr aranias is the captain so i'm in his hand and i trust him 100 percent if you suffer from a gastrointestinal disease and think you may benefit from an advanced endoscopy procedure, talk to your doctor about a referral to Long Beach Medical Center.